Hey guys, it's Brittany, and today I have my IMAX haul and just like New York City haul in general because I went to Sephora and MAC while I was there also. So yeah, I'm just going to be showing you what I got there. And also, let me know if you think this is just weird or if you like it. I knotted it right here. Do you see the knot? And right here. And then I braided it. So let me know if you think that's weird or if you like it and I could do a hair tutorial on it. But yeah, let me know on that. And then, okay, IMAX was such an amazing experience. Like, oh my gosh. And I've been asked a few times if people recognize me. And no one recognized me, but I'm totally fine with that. I'm still pretty small on YouTube compared to some other people. And um, it was just such an amazing experience. Like... I will be going back every year if they have IMATS in New York again, which I'm pretty sure they will, but yes. So I'm just going to get started with the stuff that I got at IMATS, and then I'll show you the stuff that I got at Sephora and things like that. Okay, so the first place that I went when I got there was the brush place, and I have no clue what brush place I was even at, um, to be honest, but... Okay, I was at the Royal and Land Nickel brush place. It's right there. Um, okay, so the first brush I got is obviously this crease brush. And I always have such a hard time getting this out of here. Okay. So here's what it looks like. It's not very dense but that's what I like about it because I have pretty small eyelids if you couldn't tell and so I just need something that will work for my eyelids and I really like this so far it was pretty cheap too I think it was like two dollars maybe um, of course my dog took the plastic and is now eating it so sorry for your background noise Mason okay the second brush I got is this huge kabuki brush um, it's dirty, but it's like angled, and it is so dense and so soft, and this was $7. All their kabuki brushes, no matter what size they were, they were $7. So obviously I got the biggest one that I could for $7, <laughs> but yeah, it is so soft. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, okay, then I went to the Stila booth, whatever you want to call it, Stila, S Stila section, I don't know, um, okay, and I got two things from there, I got a long wear lip, liquid lip color, and I'm not really sure if I'm gonna like this, because I thought it was gonna be a lip gloss, but then I got it home and I read long wear liquid lip color, so, I don't really know. I might put this in my upcoming giveaway. I might keep it and try it out. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Um, okay, then this thing I've already used since I've got it is the Stila um, Trios. One of the eyeshadow trio in the color Champagne Glow. And it's so pretty. And since it's baked... The eyeshadows are really pigmented. Here, I'll swatch it. Okay, so there it is, right there. And I love baked eyeshadow because baked eyeshadow is usually so much more pigmented than regular eyeshadow. So, yes. Okay, then... These are just random stores within this bag. Um, okay, so I'll start off with the thing that I got from Lush. Oh, no wonder why I could smell it. It was cracked open. It, or, like, the wrapping paper came off. Um, okay, so when I went into Lush, we were just, like, walking around shopping, and then all of a sudden I see Mac Barbie 07 and Alexander XO, and I was like, whoa! Like, how did you guys get here? And then we took pictures and stuff. And it was so cool because she put the picture in her video and I was like, oh my god. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's where I got to meet her. 
and I had already met Mac Barbie 07 at IMAX, so I didn't want to really bug her again for a picture. <laughs> but, um, okay, so the soap that I got was Honey, I Wash the Kids, and I got a $7 piece, and since I'm sick right now, anything sweet makes me just want to, like, get sick. But it smells so good, but I can't, like, smell it anymore because I'll just, like, get sick. <laughs> um, okay, then what I got from Sephora was I got a Lush Flush Lip and Cheek Stain. And this is in the color Merlot, I guess. It's right there. Okay, focus. Focus. Do you see the color? Okay. So yeah, I got this. And there's what it looks like. And I really, really, really like this. Um, okay, then I got the um, Buxom, Buxom set. Buxom, whatever you want to call it. And it comes with a lip gloss and, an, and a mascara. So, the lip gloss is so pretty. It's, here's what it looks like. It's just a baby version. And it's in the color Leslie. And it's just a really pretty milky pink color with golden reflex to it. And and it like, it's supposed to plump your lips, I think. But I don't really think it does, but I really like the lip gloss color, so it's okay. <laughs> um, okay, then it came with a, a sample size of Buxom Lash. And this is in the color, oh no, blackest black. <laughs> and I really like this mascara. Oh my god, I think this might be my new favorite mascara ever. Here's what the wand looks like. And I used it today. And oh my god, I freaking love it. Okay. Then, the last thing I got from Sephora was the Benefit Feelin' Cheeky set. And you get... These are really good sample sizes, too. You get Posy Tint, which is the more pinky version. Like, which is a more pinky tint. And that's right there. You get High Beam, which is probably my all-time, like, favorite highlighter now. And see, these samples are really good. Look, like, they're really decently sized. Okay, High Beam, which is right next to the Posy Tint. And then you get Benetint, which is probably their, like, famous tint. Well, it is their famous tint, which is right next to High Beam. Um, okay, then the last place I went was MAC, and I got a concealer in the color NW20, and I got the... Pro Longwear Concealer. And you get 9 milliliters or 0.30 fluid ounces for $16.50, which I think is a good deal, right? Yeah. Especially since I really like it too. And you're going to get a lot of use out of it. Okay, then the last thing I got on my little shopping trip. Well, not really little, but actually just kidding. I have one more thing after this. I got the MAC Plush Glass in the color Girl Heart Boy. Okay, well, that's not going to focus, but it's in the color Girl Heart Boy. And it's just a really pretty pink 
and this is in the quite cute collection that just came out. Okay, then the last thing that I got was this fake purse in Chinatown, which is right near Soho, which is where we were. And, um, okay, so I can't get these little plastic thingies off, so don't laugh at me. But, yeah, it looks like this, and I really like it. I think it's so cute. It's like the long-strapped one that you wear, like that. And, oh my god, I really like it. Mm, yeah, it's fake, but I don't really care. Um, everyone else was saying it was ten dollars or saying it was twenty five, and then he gave it to me for eighteen. And I was like, yeah, I'll take it. And but yeah, I can't get these little things off it, so I'll have to try to get those off after. So yeah, before this video gets any longer, I'm going to go. But um, yeah, let me know if you think that's weird or if you want a hair tutorial on it. And then oh yeah, ask me questions on Forum Spring. Please, I will love you for like ever. I'll link my form spring here and down there. Okay, bye guys.